What's going on everyone? One Dr. Genius here and welcome to another episode of Prodigy Breaking News. In today's episode, if you check Wizard Watch, you will see that Prodigy is giving us two times the Titan charts to beat up the Titan. Right, for a limited time only, we can get ourselves 2x Titan shards in order to defeat the Titan. So every time you battle this guy, you get two Titan shards. Won't work. We'll just have to... So as you can see, it's starting out like this, so I'm pretty sure they want the Titan dead quicker, because they usually don't do this, like, and they just let it die on its own by giving us two Titan shards. Huh, something's fishy here, let's see what it is. But as you can see, we earn ourselves two extra Titan shards for defeating one of these guys, which is quite interesting if you ask me, because it gets my attention towards it, but, uh, one second. Alrighty, so I just took care of that quite quickly, now we have ourselves a membership, and now let's get to showcasing the 2x Titan Shards per attack. Right, let's do this, let's go to the catapults. If everything goes correctly, we should get 4 Titan Shards per attack, which is insane, but at the same time it will help us progress a lot faster. Yeah, so if we do the calculations, um, if we divide everything by 2, because we'll be getting everything 2 times as fast, we should get the amount of material or the amount of times you'll have to battle the titan using the catapult. Aha! Yes, as you can see, we actually have defeated the titan. We have collected ourselves, our member stars, and... The moment of truth, how many titan shards will we get? Four! Yes, you saw that right, it seems like that prodigy has done it true and we're getting four titan shards per attack. Now let's quickly look at Harvey's shop and see how much stuff we'd have to buy for, right? Yeah. Alright, so the number which we get from this is 8,280. This is the amount of Titan Shards which you would need to require to buy up the entire shop. Now, if you divide this by all of the numbers which you have gotten, so basically, that would be 8280 by 2, which would give us 4,140 Shards required to... 4,000 and... 4,140 Battles required to defeat the to get the amount of titan shards needed from the shop by just battling the titan no catapults no nothing just normal style now if you divide this by four you guys will see this is how many battles we need to do using the catapult using the catapult we need to do 2070 battles now using our wizards we need to do approximately 1035 battles and voila there we go we have spawned it and now let's go to the battle and click join. Now from over here, let's click start. And now our monster battles have started. As you can see, we're in and now my goal is to cast approximately 5 spells each to see if we can actually get ourselves 10 titan shards each. Because if we do, that will be absolutely insane to- Oh wait, I forgot, we're supposed to click the thingy majiggy in the center to attack. I was like, hey, why is the attack option not appearing? Alrighty, so we've answered both questions at the exact same time, and let's see what happens. Alrighty, so my second account is casting their spell, and then my other account should be able to cast their spell, right? And then Titan uses Shadow Shock, which misses. Unfortunately, I somehow managed to get the question wrong on my other account. Oh no. Alrighty, so we've done it once again. Both questions have been answered at the exact same time. And as you can see, we both are casting our spells right over here. Boom, the Titan is being attacked, and now we should be able to sustain- Oh, oh okay. Okay, as you guys can see, this is quite uh, dangerous. The Titan is getting a little bit aggressive. Aha! Two questions answered properly. And now it seems like that our other council cast, and as you can see, they will work like this, but will we get ourselves 10 titan shards, because that is the movement of truth. Alrighty, once again, it seems like that somehow my Chromebook is beating the answering speed of my computer. But as you can see, now we have the titan down to only one heart left, so obviously let's both just cast the spell. If one of us misses, the other one can do it. Okay, that was sad, I answered that question wrong and missed it. But as you guys can see over here, it seems like we earned ourselves a reward of 8 titan shards, meaning the maximum we can get is 4 correct answers which will give us 8 titan shards. Battles. Okay, so we only need to do approximately 
Now using our wizards, we need to do approximately 1035 battles in Prodigy in order to get ourselves everything unlocked. So that is not too much. And on top of that, don't forget that we actually have the Titan Battle Rewards as well. And as you guys can see, it will take us the same time as last time, but we'll still get this stuff. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm quickly gonna buy out everything over here, and once we buy 9 of these, we'll have basically expensive stuff left. Now this over here is probably the most expensive requiring 2,000, and then you have this over here at 12,000, and then you have this over here, oh wait, I just realized I'm seeing 2,000, 12,000. Uh, what I mean is 1,200, like, you guys, yeah, have, have fun understanding what I'm trying to say. Then over here you'll need yourselves approximately 300, which is quite literally one of the cheapest places there is. And then over here, what you guys will need is you will need yourselves approximately 1,000, and over here you will need yourselves a grand total of... You will need yourselves a grand total of 37,800, wait. Yeah, my calculations were so wrong. But guys, that's basically all which we have time for in this video. As you can see, we do get ourselves quite a large amount of, um, of Titan Shots per battle. So it reduces the amount of battles needed from approximately 8,000 to 1,000, which is... A huge, a humongous difference if you guys ask me. So yeah, I would highly recommend you guys. I would highly, highly, highly recommend that you play in the arena as if you play in the, as for if you play in the Titans because it is quite nice. We are getting ourselves quite a lot of Titan charts for very little effort. So yeah, guys, that's gonna be all for this video. I hope you guys found this video informational. And if you were thinking, meh, this isn't too big of a deal, just remember this could be saving you approximately. Uh, Guys, just remember, this is saving approximately 15 days of work. This is saving you 15 days of work in the arena. 15 days, right? Consider that. Would you rather have to do 15 days non-stop in the arena or save 15 days? Just consider it. This is absolutely huge. So yeah, guys, I would recommend you guys do this. I'll be catching you all next time. One Dr. Genius out the house. So please subscribe, like. I'll be catching you all next time. Bye. Have a good time. I know what I'll be doing for the next few hours. Yeah, so if we do the calculations, um, if we divide everything by 2, because we'll be getting everything 2 times as fast, we should get the amount of material or the amount of times you'll have to battle the titan using the catapult. Now, I'll take the catapult as a standard. Let's quickly look at Harvey Shop and see how much stuff we'd have to buy for, right? Yeah. So that's 500 times 4, so that's 2,000. Alright, so that's 2,000 plus 900, so that's 2,900. 3,100 3,600 3,750 So in total, we'd have to get ourselves approximately 42,000 Titan Charts in order to finish this entire place off. Now normally that would be 42,000 normal battles if you were j- oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Doing it using the normal clicking on the Titan method. But since it's time to, you'd have to do 2100 battles against the Titan with the normal method where you just click on it in order to get that. Now let's try something else, right? Now, if you use the catapult, you'll have to do approximately 100. You'll have to do approximately 1,050 battles in order to defeat the Titan. Now, let's try something crazy. You guys know how, while doing the team battles, we can get a maximum of five Titan shards, right? So that means 10. That means you'd have to do 420 battles in order to get everything. Are you telling me that something that would take us approximately?